Make sure that you read the fine print and the details and look at your deductibles because if you are paying less premiums, that means that your deductible at the end is gonna be much, much higher. That's really important, I see, because many times while we're arguing these cases, one of the arguments is going to be the deductible because when we get to trial, a jury awards what they feel the damages to a roof is, but then the judge has to remove the deductible by from the award. And so many times I've seen in negotiating these matters and in going to trial. Deductible, while it can solve your premium issue in the short run, ultimately hurts you in the long run when you go to trial and you have, say, a $15,000 deductible that has to be removed. Yeah, you have to be very careful with the deductibles. Ensure that you are, number one, able to cover the difference. If you have a deductible that's $15,000, your insurance company will only pay a certain portion of your roof and you will have to come up with a $15,000. Do you have that sort of money stashed away? If you don't, then make sure that your deductible is lower, even though your premium is gonna be a little bit higher. That's really true.